so look at the switch here you can see the switch this is a switch this is a this is a, this the name of the switch this is a uh, um sorry it's closed right here let me open it so you can see So this is actually the switch. So this is a switch here. So whenever you want to solve the PU problem of this very switch, so what you're going to do, look at the model here. You can see the model. 2960X series. All 2960X series are some uh, pattern you can use to fix them. So look at the problem here. You can see the, the, the this indicator at as at PO is flashing orange light. You can see it is it's flashing. This is a PoE problem, and when it's doing like this, some ports cannot work uh, because uh, the IC controlling those ports are not uh, okay, and they are no longer good. They need to be replaced. So uh, I'm going to show you the IC that is causing this problem. Well, how do you know which one is causing the problem so let's get uh, there's a video I did uh, uh, about Cisco switches about PoE one of the, uh, the one of the does a, a switches uh, one of my previous videos uh, how you count like eight port four port but this one is uh, one IC controls eight port so I'm going to show you how it goes so you can see it's flashing orange light here is a, it shows that it has a problem so I'm gonna show you the IC responsible for that so you can want this to turn here okay first I want to show you something first before we can we can go back to the IC I want to show you something first this is my access point any port that is working is going to indicate light here here's my Cisco access point so let's start so let's start let me start from the number one port so let's start from here so so if I push uh, this uh, uh, Ethernet port in you can see a light is coming here you can see a light here coming showing that this very PoE port is working let's go to another port you can look at here you can see it's flashing light here showing that this this port is also okay let's check all the port as, as fast as we can The ports are working. It's working. It's working. It's working. It's working. this this port is it's not it's not working you can see there's no light here you can see there's no light here this port is not working you can see from the the port that is not working to the to the uh to the other port you can see the uh, from the, this is the one that's not working you can see you can count from here one two three four five six seven eight so this eight port, remember this 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 one that's not working. This eight port is controlled by IC one IC. I'm gonna show you that. Let me minute I'm show you that. So look at the ICs. I this IC. This IC, this one of this IC, this IC here, controls a uh, uh, eight port. 
this uh, this one is for 48 port and 48 ports is is has the IC number of uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 that's 6 3 port 3 IC sorry 3 IC controls uh, uh, 24 ports so that's it but I'm going to still show you the the IC the, the one of this very switch I'm gonna still show you about that one so what do you do you need to remove it remove uh this thing i i suggest if you have uh, something like complete like this uh you can it is better you know to remove it completely like this you can see the pins you can see the pins it has a uh, 50 something pins like, like 56 pins all together it has 56 pins so you have to pull it off from the the switch of the back of the port right here is the the, the 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 small circuit for the poe you you pull it off totally then uh, uh, replace it with the, the with the new one or you can if you are very good at the electronics that's good in the board work you can easily remove the replace this ic's like this one this this uh this one this eight port is not working like this port this 24 port and the the ICs at the back, they are uh, they are three pieces because this 24 port one IC controls eight port. So you can see this 24 port. So what you're going to know is the 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 IC right uh, that is at right behind uh, the port that is not working. The particular IC that is right behind the port that is not working. It's uh is the IC is going to change. When you change the IC, it's going to come back to normal. But um, I suggest you you change it as it does the completely you change the this you remove it totally but I'm going to show you the IC right now I'm going to turn the switch off then I'm show you the IC that is causing the problem so right now my switch is off so I'm going to turn the switch like this to show you the IC you can see the IC this there are three of them because this is uh this uh, 24 port so look at the IC here one two three three of them the other places are empty because uh, it is not up to uh, a 48 port so three IC controls 24 ports and each of the three ICs controls eight eight port so what you're going to do is, is you're going to change this particular one right behind the, the port that's not working so how you're going to do you have to count from the first from here one two three four five six seven eight this eight has the first ic here at the back of here then you count again one two three four five six seven eight so then this eight in the center you see that ic in the center controls the eight port in the center so the the last uh, eight port is controlled by the last ic here so what you're going to do is going to replace the ic behind the port that's not working so that's the ic i'm telling you right now this very ic we're seeing here what i suggest you remove the the you can uh, replace the whole uh, the whole circuit you pull it off then you replace it that's the the best option i don't have uh, enough time to do that practically right now uh maybe next time i can do it for you people so you can see everything how to do that but when you're good at board you can easily remove it and replace with another one is i same board from the same switch maybe this switch, the other switch you remove from is totally damaged you can't do anything with it again so you have to remove this particular one to replace this one that has only poe issues so thank you today thank you yes that's the end of the video if you like what we're doing you can subscribe subscribe to our channel so that anytime we load any video you can be able to get it be the first to get it thank you